Hello and welcome to TechCraft. This is Rob and today I've got a really quick video for you just to show you how you can improve the experience with mouse support on the iPad Pro. Let's go. So one of the problems with the mouse on the iPad Pro is that when you're not using it, there's a little dot icon left on your screen. And you can dig into the menus to try and get rid of this dot, but it's a real pain each time. Let me show you what happens. So here I am on my iPad right now, and you can see my mouse pointer is scrolling around. Now, if I turn my mouse off, by um, pressing the, mouse, the power button here, then you'll see that the pointer has disappeared, but here in the lower corner of my screen, I've got this really frustrating little icon. Now I've set that to dim, but it's still there. And if you have a dark screen, when you're, uh, when you're operating, you'll see that a lot more than you can on this light screen. So I can go into uh, settings and get rid of this. So here I am in settings. If I go into accessibility and then I go into touch, and I go into assistive touch, I can turn assistive touch off and the icon has disappeared. But obviously this is not ideal each time. So let's put that back on and let me show you the easiest way to get around this. So I'm gonna go back to my home screen and here you can see um, that I have in my shortcuts bar at the side here, I have a little shortcut called toggle mouse. And if I press that, the mouse goes off, you can see it's gone. And if I press it, there's mouse support comes back on. Really, really useful. Let's just dig into the Shortcuts app really quickly to see how I put that together. So here we are in the Shortcuts app. Uh, you can see I have a few shortcuts set up and I'm working on many, many more that hopefully I'll share with you. Um, here's the toggle mouse one, it's the second over from the left. And if I press the three dots here, we can go in to see how this is constructed. It's really simple. All I've done is ask the settings app to toggle assistive touch on and off. Let me show you though from scratch how I would build this. So if I get rid of that there. So with that deleted, let's start from scratch. So if I go into apps here and then from apps, I'm gonna scroll down to settings. And then in settings, I'm literally just gonna have uh, the set assistive touch action added to my shortcut. And then here it just says turn assistive touch on, but I want to press turn and then choose toggle instead. And that's all that's gonna happen. So every time I touch my shortcut now on the home screen, it's going to toggle assistive touch on or off depending on the current state. So let's go back to home one more time and I'll show you that in action. Press toggle um, and mouse it off, toggle and it comes on. Really powerful stuff, just a quick shortcut to really improve the experience of working with the mouse on iOS and iPad. Thanks for watching, I know this has been a quick one, I will post a lot more of these quick tips, but I am posting fuller tutorials and reviews, so please do hit like if you found this useful or you found it entertaining. Please do subscribe, and don't just subscribe, but hit the bell so you won't miss out on any new content. Other than that, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.